It's so strange that that person just ran away like that. It wasn't really flashy of him. Oh well. But with you, I can sense some flash in you. Tell me, what is your name? Ah, I see. It's not very much of a... explosive name, but I'll get used to it. My name? <laughs> Listen closely. My name is Tengen Izui, and I'm a Hashira. The sound Hashira, to be exact. You don't look impressed. Well, you should be. I'm one of the most powerful Hashira there is. Why don't you still look impressed? I am no joke. How dare you say that to me, you little munchscrat! I am a Hashira, so you're going to treat me with some respect now. Just because I look a bit more flashy than the other Hashiras does not mean I deserve not even more respect than they do. Do you understand me? Very good. Now listen to me and listen close, because I... I'm a god. <laughs> An excellent question. You may have potential in you. I am the god of all festivals. The god of flashiness. For my name is not Tengen Izui. I am the Sound Hashira. And I shall make everybody even more sparkly. Watch me as I conquer this mission. It will be a spectacle. Yes, watch me, because I'm going to be taking you under my wing as well. I know some of the Hashira have already done so, but you have potential. I can see that. Teaching you some of the... Why are you interrupting me? <laughs> you don't think I already know you're getting trained under a Hashira? Please. I know everything. And plus, with potential that you have, I'm pretty sure you could learn more than just one style of breathing. <laughs> of course you can learn two styles of breathing. It is very difficult, nonetheless. But, if you can master both of them at the same time, it'll be quite the spectacle to see in the battlefield. Hmm... You know... Taking a closer look at you, I can see a mark on your shoulder. Do you mind if I could see that a little bit closer? <laughs> I would need you to take off your shirt, is what I'm trying to say. Not in that way, you weird bottom feeder. I'm talking about so I can see the symbol. God. Alright. Let me see. <laughs> That's a demon slayer, Mark. How do you have that? You're not even up to my rank and you have a Demon Slayer mark. <laughs> Call me impressed. You have more skill than you think you do. Trust me. With a little bit more training, you'll be up to my rank in no time. Hmm? Your younger sibling? Where does your younger sibling live? Ah, oh, I see. So you're not originally from the southern regions of Japan. 
I see that now. You're from the northern region. I can say something about the northern region of Japan is a lot more flashier than it is down here. With all their technology and whatnot. Hmm. <laughs> well, I mean, if you are only taking a visit here, it would be more than wise for you not to learn my breathing technique. Because it does take a long time. <laughs> of course. Sound breathing is one of the most difficult ones out there. And plus, reading attacks? That takes months to learn. So, since you're only visiting here, I'm not going to teach you anything. But you do have potential. I can see that in you. So, if you ever want to learn something, come to me. I can teach you something even more dramatic than you would think you could ever see in your life. It will be a spectacle. Mm-hmm. I do not sense any type of danger around here, though, so I can put my swords away. For right now, at least. Hmm? A notification? What is that? Ah, oh, a message. I keep forgetting. You're in the northern region. Technology is more advanced up there. All right, what does this message say? You're... you're kidding, right? Let me see. Oh, wow. You... you... you weren't kidding. USA's been destroyed. Nuclear bomb? That's crazy. It's very flashy, but not in a good way. No fragments found whatsoever of a bomb? Then what could it have been? If it was a nuclear explosion and it took out all the United States, it must have been huge. Hell, it could have been even seen from space. That's how flashy and big it was. How did no one find this out? Well, obviously, it's because that happened, but... Wow. That's very sad. But at least some of them survived, right? Right? Oh. I see. <sighs> May their souls be at peace, at least. And let their lives in the afterlife be as flashy as possible. But, nonetheless, we have to keep living on for their sake. And it makes sense, doesn't it? To live the lives that they could never. To show them what real flashiness and what a true life is, is on us now the rest of the world. Well, I shouldn't be taking up your time any longer. I'm also looking for some acquaintances to be on my next mission. I need females to be on my quest. <laughs> I'm sorry, but... If you are considering yourself a female, you're not quite as pretty as I thought I would need for my acquaintances for this mission. So, I'm going to have to pass on you. I apologize. But nonetheless, I shall get going on my own mission. You, sir, or ma'am, or whatever you call yourself, I am going to be going. 
It was nice talking to you, though. Hmm. Make sure you visit us next time. Have a flashy night. Ha, 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 ha.